Welcome to the video, campaign one, uh, page mission eight, the causeway. Previously, I managed to uh, um, make a peace with an assassin and a cleric, and we were going to the gathering inside of the monastery. Uh, the causeway. General Ronel quickly dismounts his horse and charges up the stone steps of the monastery causeway. Several of his soldiers chase behind him, calling out to him for, or for his orders. The general bellows to the gatekeeper. The enemy is upon us! Sound the alarm! As the bell tolls, a group of rotting corpses lurch on their feet toward the monastery grounds. Behind them, the renowned necromancer, Biala, walks toward the church. Ah, this must be the gathering of the veil, <laughs> Biala cackles. Did you forget to invite the practitioners of the dark arts? Perhaps you need to be reminded who rules this world? Mm, will you? Uh, A. Fight the knights without the aid of the zombies. Uh, the necromancer may yet reward your yo loyalty. Or B. Send these corpses back to the grave. Fight the zombies without the aid of the, of the knights. The zombies take their turn. Second, there are five zombies. <laughs> Plus five for each additional hero in your party. Or the knights take their turn. Second. So we have to make a choice here. Well, zombies have three health, <laughs> knights have five health. Uh, I think I'll do the, the zombies, but of course a priest, come on. There is no real choice here. Uh, so, we have to kill all the zombies. And I go first. Uh, I didn't have uh, five zombies, so let's pretend the other things are uh, zombies uh, uh, and you don't read the skeleton. So the uh, knights don't do anything. Draw four cards and go first. This should be a piece of cake. Famous last words. Okay, uh, heal. Shuffle one of your banished cards into the fey deck. Oh yeah, which reminds me, um, what do the enemies do? Let's take a look at the zombie. Uh, when this enemy dies, flip a coin and return it to full health. Health if the coin lands tails. Oh my God, we need a coin. I hate these games. Um, okay. So they have more than three health. Uh, the five zombies, uh, two and a half, uh, should revive once more. And then uh, out of the two and a half, one more. So three and a half. It's eight and a half zombies, actually. Uh, but. Uh, can we combine stuff? I think I want something... The three... Uh, actually... I'm going to... I want to buy... So I have the Sanctified. It uh, does for... It's a, it's a recruit, uh, and that should help me a lot. It costs me... I think I don't want to mulligan, uh, that's for sure. So, there is no there is no aura in my fate route yet, so I cannot use the one coin from the priest, but I can do the blessed covenant. This is worth three. So I can play the recruit immediately. Now I have an aura. Okay. So I have actually one coin left from the priest. And this is green and green. Doesn't do 
much and these two mm, so I have one from the priest plus two from radiance is three from knights okay I think we and another aura great and the auras work immediately recruits you control have plus one health uh, let's denote it with a plus one when this card is in your fate route spectral aura uh, steal one or um, gain one money it's not very useful but I'm going to use it so now for burning some zombies the sanctified does four damage so that is getting rid of one of the well wanna be zombies so this is used uh, sorry this is used um, well this doesn't do much this doesn't do much uh, of anything so it goes away um, two damage from radiance and three damage to a zombie from blade of exile blade of exile do just does, does three damage I may banish a card from my hand discard by all fade outs don't want to so this is done uh, this not yet this is done Knights do 3 damage uh, on their own, plus 3 damage if there is a red card. Well, there are enough red cards, so, so they kill off 2 zombies. Um, yeah, well... I'm reading this as 2 separate actions. Um, so because the zombie is not a um, a recruit, damage doesn't carry over. But uh, this kills one and this kills the other. That's how I interpret it. So uh, that is another zombie <laughs> making minced meat of these guys. Uh, ridiculous. And this is the other zombie. Okay. Uh, so that was the knights. <laughs> uh, you might say I was extremely lucky so the 2 damage from Radiance kills the last zombie that was pretty much a one shot <laughs> I'm s I've <laughs> okay it's getting a bit weird um, so let's read uh, you, you kill all the zombies. Back to the earth with you, foul creatures of death, you cry. You look back and see other clerics and soldiers fighting off the last remaining gulls. Didn't see gulls. Uh, good has triumphed over evil this day. And now for Beala. Mm, reward for a cl cleric, priest or paladin. Priest. Righteous Aura, for the remainder of the campaign, whenever you use the hero ability, um, that is the plus one money, you may also heal five health distributed to the heroes in your party as you choose. Oh, well, that's pretty great. How do I denote this? Hmm, okay, I'll uh, make some notes. Mm. Continue on page 10. So we are skipping something with a, with a crime lord. <laughs> the gathering. You follow Biala into the foyer of the 
church. It seems every eye in the sanctuary watches her suspiciously. As you approach her, you cannot help but wonder how many here would applaud her murder. The priests have created a fine enchantment in this church, Biela grins. We cannot harm each other or cast any spells while inside its walls. Uh, you watch the necromancer closely as she steps further into the sanctuary. There are soldiers and casters from every order. At the pulpit stands the assassin, Fishner, who begins to speak. Most of us are enemies now and will leave here as enemies still. But one thing we all have in common, the veil. Our ancestors vowed to protect this world from the corruption of, of the dark worlds beyond the veil. My spies have found an ancient temple. There, warlocks seek to open a gateway. If we cannot stop them from their task, all the world could be consumed by death and shadow. A raspy voice from the dark interrupts. It is far too late for any of you to stop me. A bearded man in ashen robe steps into the light. He extends a withered hand to the window. Your little enchantment will not stop, not stop the teeth of my demons. Stevens shouts Xernon, the, the wizard. Quickly, lower the enchantment. We are defenseless. Grawl vanishes into the shadows as a hulking winged demon crashes through the church window. The demon takes his turn first and has 66 health. Mm, the slay mechanic will be used to instantly kill the demon. And does he go first? Uh, after you, you land Oh, well, I think I go first because I have lower health. Um, the demon crumbles into ashes. But this is the first time uh, it's an actual game over, so I really don't want to die here. Okay, let's let's go. This is silly. So this was useless. So in a nightmare mode, the uh, skeletons or the zombies uh, would have had had to go first because they have lower health. I'm not sure about this. Okay, uh, I did buy some stuff. What did I buy? The knights, I think. Something else here. Blessed Covenant, Radiance, Blade of Exile, Heal, uh, this is Blessed Covenant, okay, how many cards, 1, 2, 4, 5, 6, 7, I'm missing one, I had two Blessed Covenants, I had one green, Hmm. Perhaps I have the Blade of Exile. Radiance. Yeah. Okay. So I have eight cards. Shuffle a little bit. Right, 
we have reinforcements. Sanctified. Sanctified is pretty cool. We have a heal. And we have a yielding. And yielding is interesting, I think. 30 health. 35, 45, 46, 66. Okay, what does this do? Nine damage to each recruit, uh, to each hero, then slay and banish a recruit from each hero if able. Slay and banish. Okay, that's not nice. It doesn't say if I go first. Let's have sure I go first. It's four cards. Uh, do I want to? I can do six damage, but I cannot buy anything. So the sanctified is nice because he's going to slay stuff. I'm going to mulligan these. The help of a uh, aura because auras are awesome. The white wizard, a divine intervention, and another heal. But I'm not wounded yet, so I'm keeping this. I'm just doing four, six damage. Six damage. the guy. Okay, draw up to five, three, four, five. Demon goes nine damage. Twenty-five is sixteen. Okay, now I'm going to. To the Shrine of Light. Let's do this. Like that. Uh, four extra. And these two heal. Mm, no. This just does six extra, um, but I cannot go over my starting health. Uh, so nine, it's five. Suboptimal, but who cares? Um, not going to use what is under it. Um, I'm going to do. So damage um, so um, three plus two is five. I'm going to Banish the white wizards with my dispel. Gives me knights. Knights are awesome. Sorry about the bump. Uh, I can buy the knights. I can buy the sanctified. But I have no need for the sanctified. I buy the knights. The knights do two times three damage. So that's six. Because of radiance synergy. Um, and they are re uh, recruits. Oh my god. They have no extra health. They're going to die. Okay, drawing up to five. Two, three, four, five. Now it's the demon turn. Demon does slay a hero. 
No, nine to each hero, then slay and banish a recruit. So nine to me, then slay and banish. That's not fun. Um, okay, I need to heal. Plus four. I need to heal. 